Excuse me. I'm a street photographer. Can I take your photograph just as you're sitting like that? You look absolutely fantastic. How you doing guys? I'm Sean. Welcome to Rambles with my camera. Guys, today's Ramble. Today's video. I just want to start uh, by saying thank you all so much uh, for all the positive vibes, all the comments and the likes. And a big shout out to all the new subscribers. And as usual, all the old subscribers, you're all very, very welcome. So, this video here, I'm just going to be adding some photographs that I've taken over the past month. Um, sorry that the videos haven't been going up as much as it was when I was in uh, Waterford. Putting up two uh, videos a week then. And I had all these ideas when I came up to Belfast again that was going to be, uh, you know, putting on like many videos every day. But it's had the opposite effect. And I think really what that's down to. It's because I'm out taking photographs, I'm out networking, uh, catching up with friends, and uh, both old and new, and really just having a blast. So the videos have been sort of slack. You're talking about one a week, uh, one every two weeks, nearly. So my apologies, but I'm out taking photographs, so I suppose that's something. And look at that weather, so you couldn't be sitting on a computer um, doing it. I have to say, like, I'm not too sure if you do um, make videos. I'll just get across here every second. There we go. I'm not too sure if you actually have made videos for YouTube. Now, obviously, depending on what it is, but by the time you tweak the photographs, by the time you actually uh, edit the video, render it, upload it, you know, you wouldn't see too much time out of six hours has gone past, depending on the, the video. So, really, what you want to do is Notice this is back like six hours, eight hours sitting in front of a computer putting a video out. No matter how much I love making videos and much I love my channel, but look, life's worth living, and that's what I'm doing. So, no more waffling. What I'm going to do now is going to put a load of photographs on that I had taken and to have a wee look. Guys, listen, thanks again. I really appreciate you joining me on this journey. Now, get out there, take some photographs after you watch this uh, video, of course. Lady sitting there, she looks pretty class. Let me see what happens now. This could go either way. She looks fantastic. Um. Excuse me. I'm a street photographer. Can I take your photograph just as you're sitting like that? You look absolutely fantastic. Yeah, okay. Yeah, just exactly. Perfect. Love your tattoo, by the way. Can I take that out of the way, Michelle? I'll take that here. That's beautiful. I don't want to bend. Listen, thanks very much. So what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to sit here, well sit here, stand here, and actually wait on somebody going past with a pair of shades, and then you'll be able to tell, to get a, uh, a shot on it. There's no other shades. I haven't got the wide angle lens on you see, so I know they're not, he's not going to be in shots. So what I could do is I could actually stand out a bit, so it means he's going to walk, walk up here, because I'm standing here obviously. I'm going to get him there. Um, that doesn't have a feeling. 
have luck focus on the thing there. So you go, another guy. So there's a girl across the street there. The girl across the street there could probably make a nice photograph. Let me see. We've got a red light, I've got a bit of a green background there. Let me see now. Grab a seat here now. Guy Neil and that photograph. Well done, huh? Is there a difference between a photographer and somebody who's just taking a snapshot, taking a real photograph? Huh? Now, did you see that there? With their suit and all on them. I'm a businessman. But watch him taking a photograph. Good to see. That's the difference between a real photographer and a bluffer. Real photographers, possible photographs there. We could have sat right in the sand there. Okay. Big tattoos in your woman's back there. So what I'm gonna do with this one here, obviously this lady's flesh is gonna be the exact same, obviously as my hand. So if I take a light reading of my hand here, and I get it at I'm getting it at uh, shutter speed at 640 and F22. So what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to walk over and the only problem I'm going to have is, is if you look at the shadow here, my shadow is going to hit her back, which I don't want to do. So I'll just go over and have a look and see. I might have this side tell her. Excuse me. Hiya, I'm a street photographer. I just took a photograph of your back. Your okay. tattoo is fantastic. Is that okay? Do you mind if I shoot over your back just as you're taking it? Uh, do you have any cards or anything? Uh, you have no cards left. Are you look for rambles with my camera? Okay guys, I'm not too sure if you actually heard what the lady said. She said, have you got a business card on you? Now, those of you who be familiar with my other videos, I've always said tell you to get some sort of business card, some sort of presence there that you actually hand out a card. Unfortunately, I handed out about 50. Um, over the past couple of days and I never refilled uh, the pouch that I had in my camera bag so I had none so guys just the, the lady was fantastic there was no issues at all but you know get yourself business cards so you actually the, the people can actually sit and have a look and check you out so if you heard that's what she actually asked have you got a business card so there you go you have no cards left you look for rambles with my camera rambles with my camera later down for you um, I've got a YouTube channel and uh, Facebook page and you'll see the photographs on that. And it's, I'll send you a photograph that you can't have. You look yeah, fantastic, by the way. Thank you. Thank you. It's a great day to be, isn't it? So look, what I'm thinking of doing is, um, obviously I was in the city hall there and I seen the guys, uh, they had their skateboards and they were coming down. So I've got the standard lens of a 35mm lens, which is equivalent to a 50mm lens. Um, 
and it's not going to be good enough for the shutdown. They're going to change lenses now. I'm going to put on to the 18 to 55, and I'm going to approach the guys and see if I can get the three of them to come up towards me, and I'll fire off. So listen, we'll roll with the, the video in a wee second. Let me change the lens. Basically, what I'm looking at here, I'm going to get a light reading. I'm going to put the camera up until five frames a second. I'm interested to see what happens here now because the guys are dead on. So we've got one skateboarder, we've got two. So I'm just going to observe this first of all, see what the crack is. I would love to get them as they're coming up and maybe getting a, a shot off them. Thanks. But can I ask you a favour? What's this? Can I, I'm, I've got a YouTube channel, yeah. Can I get a photograph of you and your mate? Is there two pieces? No, what are you doing now? You're flipping it up as you were coming along? Is it possible to get the two just going at the same time on the possible? Now I get on the ground and just we'll whack the cup and I'll send you back. I'll send you back. Yo, Dave! I've got three of the guys. And Dave. I think I made a photograph that guy before. Hey brother. Yeah, How are you, man? Remember me? Yeah. That's that, uh, do you alright? I took yeah, a yeah. photograph. How are you? I did, yeah. Can I get a photograph just send your mate there? Yeah. I'm thinking that, say it's for top secret three if he's coming towards me, I'm going to get on the ground, right? Yeah. And we'll fire back to back tricks if you want. Mm. Back to back tricks, like all three of us will come towards you and then. All three of us will do a trick each. Brilliant. Make a different trick yeah, each. Brother. That one that you can like. Right, so basically what I'm going to be doing, the guys are all going to come up this side here, and I'm going to hit the pre-focus here as you go on. Um. Can you get the light reading here? Guys, absolutely really nice guys, and uh, met them before. Met them about four days ago. Um, a couple of them I took her photographs, sent them photographs. But I think it's just fantastic that just fantastic people being so kind enough to do it. Well, I've never tired, I'm sure. But we've got the shots, so come on, let's keep it going anyway.